first of all you will need the driver for adb and fast boot uh, you have to install it on your own i will have the link in the description after installing open the winusb.inf file that i have opened and add the two lines uh, at the end of it that i have already added Now extract the two files. One has the files for ADB and Fastboot, and the other one has Google Play Edition firmware. Now extract both of them in the same folder in the C drive somewhere. After you finish copying, uh, just open your mobile in bootloader mode by pressing the volume down and power key at the same time. After that, connect your mobile to your PC. After connecting your mobile to PC, uh, run either of these two, any KitKat firmware to 4.4.4 GP or the Brazilian 5 to 4.4.4 GP. If you have any other firmware other than the Brazilian Lollipop, then you can use the first one. Now your mobile has been converted to a Google Play Edition, you will have to flash the OTA. Now copy the OTA zip file from where you have downloaded it to this folder. Do not rename it please. After this you will have to open your mobile in recovery. To open in recovery first go to bootloader mode by pressing the power button and volume down key and, and then select recovery using volume down and the volume up key when you see the broken android logo hold the volume up key for 5 seconds and tap on the power key this will bring you a bunch of options just select apply update from adb and connect your phone to pc if you have done everything correctly this window should pop up when you run side load lollipop dot bat file it will transfer the data from a PC to your mobile and then flash it automatically. This process will take around 15 minutes so you will have to be patient. If you have the Indian dual sim version then you will also have to install the network fix. To install this just open your mobile in bootloader mode and then run that bad file. That's it. Give a like and subscribe to my channel if you like this.